In this video, I will show you how to prevent myocular injection in PHP. The simple way use the, we can use the s slash PHP function to prevent myocular injection. They just add the backslash before character, a single code, double code, a backslash, and now. In the PHP file, we have a better function called MySQLi real escape string. In the old version PHP, we just use the MySQL and no MySQL R here. MySQL real escape string. So let's look at the code here. So you, when the user posts the username and password, here, for example, use post Jensen, password they post here. Because the password, they can post anything. They can put a single code here, 2 equal to put here. So in this single code, they will cause the MySQL injection. So let's look at the query. Select so star from user login this table where username is the post username. And password is post password. Let's look at this query here. Echo this query. Let's run this code. So now we have this query. Let's put in a MySQL database to see what happened. So I have a user login table here. I have three rows. One is the username James, and one is the test, one is Dave. So let's look, run this query here. So I run this query, so that from user, this is the query I copied from my SQL. So let's run this code. You can see here, return three rows. Because we use the username, a lot username here, password is this one. But the problem is we this cause injection is all two equal to. That is it means this this name is always true. So you return all the username table here. So user don't know any password, they can hack in your system. Just use this statement. They can see all the username, they just can log in your system without any password. So how to prevent this MySQL injection? So we can use another statement called at least one. Use the password, I use s slash function, then I add a slash in this password. So let's run this code again. Now we have a new statement here. You see how the s slashes, it adds slashes in the single code and s slashes at a single code here. So let's run this statement. In the my in SQL here. So let's run this code. You can see here now my SQL return an empty result. You cannot see anything. Because now password is use this one. This is the after s slash this total is equal password. So this password now is not nothing password is from here. Because we use the s slash here. So in summary, we can use the s slashes in MySQL and PHP to prevent MySQL uh, injection. We also can use MySQL uh, uh, LRI uh, escape string, another function to prevent MySQL injection. Thanks for your watching.